So Rohit Shetty is back with the Scorp universe and we're gonna get all the twist turns, cameos, everything in this film because we have a five minute long trailer just like Suryavanshi and from the thumbnail itself you can see it's gonna be quite crowded. We have almost what four, five, six, six actors just on the thumbnail and there are more and they are not even rumors, it's now announced that Chulbul Pandey, Salman Khan's character is also gonna show up as a cameo or a post credit, I don't know what. And, uh, you know, this is a, you know, cinematic universe where it's not like, you know, they plan it out. They just made these cop films and they're like, let's bring them together. And they did that. So there's no point finding logic in how this, you know, universe works. They did set up a big villain with Jackie Shroff's character. And I guess they are building on that. Now, why do they need so many cops in this? What's the story I think we're going to get from this five minute long one? Hopefully this time they do resist sharing too much in the trailers. Keep some surprises for the theaters. And this is a proven brand by Roy Shetty. He himself says that you know not everyone is his audience he makes his films for the particular audience who enjoys his films and they come to theater and watch it even Surya Vanshi during pandemic made a lot of money he has a proven track record but am I his audience maybe not but I am you know always looking forward to something different at least they're trying to make a universe let's see how they bring it together how fun it is because that's the point of it at the end of the day and I am a fan of the first singer movie I really enjoyed it and I've seen multiple times over the years so let's see what we're getting on Diwali let's check it out a lot of references to Ramayan also by the way from the posters okay it was great Quite big, huh? Okay. We have the machine gun. Oh, he's the villain, right? Yep. Okay. There. Oh, ho. Okay. Okay, little over. Okay. One more. Very interesting visual though. Oh -ho. Okay. I see the theme they are following. So, we know 50% of the film already. 
सीता का एक लौता मंदिर है जहाँ सीता माँ पूजी जाती हैं। जहाँ जहाँ हनुमान जी ने कदम रखे वहाँ उनके पैरों के निशान बनते गए और कहा जाता है कि ये उनमें से ही एक है स्लो मोशन रन इज वेरी वियर ये कलयुग है अपनी कलयुग इस बार रावण जीतेगा सच्चाई की जीत युग की मोहताज नहीं होती ओके वो की पब्लिक को मालूम है कौन कौन आने वाला है तेरे को नहीं मालूम सूर्य वंशी Oh my god what is this action set piece Tere samne jo khada hai wo Mahatma Gandhi ka aadar zarur karta hai lekin puchta Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj ko hai They brought everything ah huh? Avenger pose मराठा छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज महात्मा गांधी देव रॉट एवरी वन You kind of get what the story is, what is bringing them all together, how it's gonna happen, how is police dealing with police inspectors from different locations in charge of different regions dealing with something anti-terrorist squad or going abroad for an I don't know a plan like mission. <laughs> I don't know how that works, but don't ask that logic here. They are. the superhero cops and they can come together and do anything they want and uh, there were quite wild action moments there too long film and they you didn't need to show so even like this like you know just the restraint if you have not shown so many stuff it's like okay this is okay they are coming together i see i see and that's it get ready for what you're getting into no this is going to happen then this will also happen then this will also happen then this will also happen and then this will also happen and then this also and we are going from there to there and there and it 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 see it's going to be a big enjoyable entertainer film or it's going to be just a mess you know there is no in between because how much things are going on in there they catch uh his character uh come on uh Shroff, come on! Not Tiger Shroff, his father. Oh, that is interesting. Will they share screen space? Jackie Shroff. So he catches that character. He was in Pakistan and working from there. So how did he catch him? What happened there? Maybe the film starts with that, and then this new villain. Who is this new villain? How does Jackie Shroff knows him? So they didn't reveal much about that villain. It's like the villain saying this time the he knows he's evil and he's Ravan and he's like this time I will win. What is the Sri Lanka connection there? uh okay finally interesting that now it's not just pakistan we are going to sri lanka also something different i i actually saw a movie called paradise where they went to that temple where ma sita is you know uh worshiped and they are going everywhere <laughs> with this so you know this one thing of subtleness don't expect that from a rojet film because they are like in your face every ramayan reference in your face so two new additions we have dipika padukone uh, she is trying it felt a bit the dialogue didn't land for me that well but again the movie it may but uh, you know you get you could see considering the caliber of an actor you can see they are at least bringing something just like ranveer with simba but uh, the moment tiger shroff i don't think even got a dialogue here and there uh, but again just doing his stunts that's it nothing much akshay kumar pops up there is a comedy line written but uh, yeah that was okay like Okay, I don't know. Maybe I hope everything they which we didn't see, the remaining part of the film is more entertaining than whatever we got. That's the only you know thing you can expect. Thank God, Chulbu Pandey no reference or nothing. Hope they save it for the movie. And maybe he's not even there. It's just a big rumor that is being you know spread around. But if he's there, uh, hopefully it's saved for the movie itself. 
wherever he shows up you know there was this post after that you know being spread that this universe has no continuity this actor was in singham one then they showed up in simba also then they were in this movie also and then they were in chulbul pandey universe also when they died and now they're here and they are playing different characters like solo mix baji but again as i said no one cares you know it's not a universe planted like a mcu where everything has to make sense or even a horror comedy universe like three where actually things come together in a very well placed manner Uh, so don't don't expect any of those things here it doesn't look that bad and horrific and what nonsense as i said again i'm not that audience he's targeting to but i'm willing to you know watch what he's bringing i may not be a fan of suryavanshi also there were moments cool moments but i like simgam one i think as a whole story emotion wise everything works simba is was fine uh, then suryavanshi was okay you know uh, not again i, I i'm not bad i it doesn't look bad or horrific or anything. like if you're expecting those logical things and this and it's a universe so it should work like this and they are superheroes they just come there's no logic of how rules and everything works they're going to come together they have daya also uh, darwaza tod and Karina is kind of you know everywhere she's caught then i think they rescue her again she's caught they rescue her so yeah a lot is going on as i said there are some vfx moments which are not looking that good also i think because of so many actors it's very hard to get them at one time so there are moments where you feel like oh these actors were not there and then later in post they've added them so you can it looks off uh, but again you know the end point if he's able to entertain with everything that's happening all of these people coming together it feels like singa must take on a back seat here with all these people coming up and they are versed in you know singa must their guru he was the starter of this universe i wonder if he kind of retires or you know he is passes away and passes the mantle to someone else like that's this is the last movie of ajay devgan singa that will be interesting like i would have liked his mustache look which is there in one way you wear in the uniform but other than that i think he's a fugitive running away that's why is different look but i think that mustache look is so unique to singam's character and there's so many roles so they even plays with that normal you know kind of uh, light beard so that actually makes him stand out so that's not happening a lot of cars turns cars are flying cars are rotating cars are flipping they are destroyed in front of you uh don't again as, as i said you know this it's stupid to complain and you know talk about physics and this that's his style let's not you know complain and talk how can that happen this is not possible like that's not the realm of roshetty universe movies he likes to do stylized the way he wants to do it and he's doing it after that what he's giving with that that's what we can talk about and uh, it's this versus bulbalaya 3 both franchises which have started something and now they are just you know become something else altogether so it will be interesting and i actually recently watched the exhibitors round table the reaction will be out but i will be for the members early and there they talked about this clash and why it's not actually good because both films are actually targeting the same kind of audiences mass audiences so it will hurt but let's see what happens on this diwali the film was supposed to release on 15th august and then they shifted back due to the delay consider the whole you know theme is ramayan and all of that it makes total sense that they're coming on diwali so i don't i think it's good a blessing for them that you know the film got delayed if the film works i think we are going to get some spin offs we will get a ladies and singam movie they are officially kind of announced her name and i think uh, roy shetty talked about in an interview that they are working on something a female oriented cop movie overall it just looks like a roy shetty film and uh, i think if someone is fan of those they get entertained by it i think you're looking forward to something on diwali and first november so look forward to it uh, i don't know when i'll get to see it because i'm away uh, for diwali so whenever i get to watch it i'll definitely share my thoughts but do let me know your thoughts in the comments below and you can check out my reaction to this video here and i will see you next time